What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy G Dub, G Shock Warrior, three ones. Um, I, I'm not gonna lie to you. I was kind of bored. I was kind of bored at home. I had nothing to do. So an idea hit me for a video. Um, I don't know how many of you guys out there know what a slingshot is. If you don't know, you need to know. And if you don't know, you should find out. This is how you find out. This video right here. I'm going to use it as a small review for the Miguel Ayako Slingshots collab. And I'm also going to show you how a slingshot works. Not in depth, but, you know, quick brief. Um, there's a reason that's there. I'll let you know in a second. But, in case you didn't catch it in my other video, let me show you what a Miguel Ayako Slingshot is. Uh, let's take you over here to this side of my room let's cut this flash real quick and as you can see I've been having it charging so it works for y'all hey there it is Miguel Yako's collab slingshots if you didn't know glows in the dark Isn't that beautiful it shines so bright it's ridiculous you can hold it up to something and it works as a light is that serious Ah, uh, beautiful, beautiful piece. I actually fell in love with this. If I'm not wearing it, it's charging. Anytime I need to run out of the house and grab a watch, I just grab this. It's just that nice. I might wear it tonight. If I go out, you know, go see Fast Fury 6. See boy's home from break now. So let me take this and this beautiful glow. Isn't that sick? Like you're... you're G-Shock can literally glow in the dark. Like, who doesn't want that? <laughs> oh, man, this is beautiful. Look at that glow. It's neon. Picture that on your wrist. In the dark? Are you kidding me? You imagine a movie theater or something? You just move, and it's like, what the heck was that? But, um, all right, let's put the flashback on. Alright, so let me show you how G uh, Slingshocks works. You have yourself a watch. Matter of fact, you know what? I ain't even going to do y'all like that. I'm going to pull out a watch. And I'm going to pull out the same model. Just so y'all don't have a hard time. Crack this right here on the bed. See if I can pop it open. There it is. There it is. A lot of people say this model looks nice on the on the sling on the a Yako too, but you know, um, G Dub don't want to play with his limiteds like that. Come on, Maharishi, come on, Maharishi. I know you're European and all, but you ain't gotta make it a tough time. All right, there you go. All right, slide off. All right. So this is how Slingshot works. You ready? Check this out. You have your watch, right? Okay. In the instance of the Ayako, we have the rose gold. It's the rose gold in there. See that? Matching Daytona rose gold, Lonus. Anyway. Okay, so what happens is you take this little tool right here. Every slingshot you buy comes with that little tool right there. It looks like a screwdriver type thing right there. See that? That's the one that came with the Ayako. Comes right there. Just pull it out. And it's easy. And it's as easy as I'm going to tell you it is. You take the little buckle, you take the little screwdriver looking thing, and right there, right there as you can see, right above the back plate, there's two little entrances to the band. Right there, you see them? They're like two eyes. You slide the screwdriver in there, and you pull towards the middle of the band. Pull in on both sides. And the band literally pops right off. So what you're going to be left with is three things. Got y'all right now. What you're going to be left with is keep my bands in here so we don't have a problem. Along with a bunch of Danny Handsome stickers. This is what you're going to be left with. Your two bands. Right? And make sure not to lose a little spring that's on the inside of the bands. See it there? Is 
There's your top band, and here's your bottom band. They literally pop right off. It's easy. Anybody can do it. It doesn't take a G-Shock expert or nothing. Pop that off, and what you're going to be left with is the bezel. Right? You're going to be left with the bezel. No bands. You're just holding the bezel like this. And then once you take that bezel, you go to the back of the slingshots or the front, however you find it easier to get it in there. Because it's tough resin. It's not don't no cheap rubber. This is beat somebody up with this. It's a pretty tough. It's, it's tough resin. Slide it in the you slide it in the hole, whether through the front or the back. And all of a sudden, you have yourself a slingshocks. They're awesome because they're cheap. Sixty nine hundred models go for like twenty five bucks each. So for the price of <clears throat> one G. You go out there and you get yourself a military style all black six nine hundred hundred dollars. For the next hundred dollars, you can get yourself four slingshots and have yourself basically what's four different watches. You can buy a yellow one, a powder blue one, a white one, and a pink one. You slide the six nine hundred bezel in all of them, and it's like you have four different watches. You change them with your outfit. It's a lot easier. And I'll show you how easy it is to pop it to pop it out too if you really want to see. It's really not that hard. See that? Now the resin just comes right off. But it holds on pretty tight. Like, I'm not lying to you guys. This is actually my first one. It, it feels good on the wrist. It's easy. It's comfortable. You can beat it up because it's a slingshot. It's not your actual watch. Your watch is protected. So if you still have the shock resistance and all that good stuff of the watch. You're just changing the outside of it. Alright? If y'all want, I'm going to lean this watch right here. I'm gonna leave the video for the camera right there. And I don't like to do this much. But we're gonna lean it right there. If it falls, it falls. Alright. Y'all can still hear me. I'm throwing it on the wrist real quick so y'all can see what it looks like. And I know I don't like doing this, but this is a special case. This is not it's your normal G. Alright. Shout out to Miguel for the design on the sling. Shout out to Brett at Slingshocks for the idea of Slingshocks. It's an awesome, awesome, awesome idea. Check this out, fellas. Look at that. It looks like a G. Sits a little higher on the wrist. You still press the buttons. <clears throat> Nothing changes. You just have some new designs. They got a bunch of collabs. You want to go to their website? The website is right here. TheSlingshocks.com. Check it out. Pick one up. Because G-Dub told you to. Just one. If it's a 6900, it's 25 bucks. If it's any other piece like this, holds GA 110s, GD 100s, GD 110s, and GA 100s, you throw this on, it's like 30 bucks. So it's worth it in my eyes. Um, it's an awesome, awesome collab. It glows in the dark. Like this is, it's self-explanatory. It's one of those things that once you pick up, you'll understand on your own. All right. So, shout out to Miguel Yako. It's an awesome collab. It glows in the dark. There might be some of these still left on the Slingshots website. If you go to shop, limited edition, there was only 250 of these made. We all picked one up. Me, Danny, Chris, Mike. You know. Shout out to that little thing of ours. We all, most of us got one. And it's just awesome. Like, there's really no other way, no other way to put it. Like, it's rare, but at the same time, it's like you can use it as a daily driver because your watch is in no harm at all. All right? That simple. That's it. I just wanted you guys to see a close-up look of the Miguel Ayako. I told Miguel I'd do an up-close and personal of his review, of his piece. <laughs> shout out to Miguel, of course. You can mix and match. Throw different models in there. I heard the Maharishi looks good in there. I know that Nigel 2 looks good in here. So it's just, it's on you guys. All right, if y'all pick one up, let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think of shit, slingshots in general. I know it's a different thing, and it was under the radar, and it was like, kind of just came out of left field for you guys. We've known about them for a while. I just wanted you guys to kind of see how we look at everything now. But yeah, sorry for the lighting. I turned it off from my, I turned the lights off in my room so you guys can see how this glue in the dark, but. Um, yeah, that's about it, alright? Your boy D-Dub signing off. Much love. Don't follow your dreams, chase them, and let me know what you think about the slingshot, alright?
Peace.